We're here at 4621 Boxford Road. We'll take a quick peek around the neighborhood. We have a nice front yard, nice landscaping. It's a cul-de-sac over there off to the left. Uh, real quiet neighborhood though. Uh, very family uh, friendly in the sense that a lot of kids riding the bike around on the weekends and stuff. So uh, definitely ideal uh, for family friendliness over here. You do have a two-car garage, a side door entrance over there on the right as well. As we head up to the front of the house, uh, we'll take a peek inside. Usually uh, it's more landscaping done up there, but due to weather, we got as we come inside, uh, off to the left here you have uh, what could be a couple things. I mean, you can use it as a you know formal sitting area if you'd like, or kind of playroom, office kind of sitting area as they have it here. Um, as we step through, this leads into what would typically be the, the formal dining room, I suppose. Here you have the chair molding uh, all the way around. The whole house has just recently been uh, painted, so uh, freshly painted, so definitely nice there. As we come into the kitchen, you have a very uh, open atmosphere in here. Uh, you have uh, relatively new appliances. The dishwasher's brand new there. Um, as you guys can see, they're just really awesome kitchen of course they have this fantastic uh, little device here to to hang the fans I can't think of the name of it but uh, definitely excellent you have a little coat closet as well uh, off to the right there um, but plenty of cabinet space just kinda letting you guys take a look real quick you have more cabinet space down here in this lovely little island area uh, nice fridge a lot of natural light as you can look out uh, you have a ceiling fan above here as well but you can look out uh, onto the pool area and uh, onto the deck over there as well so I'll do one last uh, little pan across here uh, from the kitchen different angle so you guys can see a lot of natural light and of course you do have that uh, nice lighting up above there as well as you guys can see that um, in the main living area absolutely magnificent magnificent looking you do have the chair molding all the way around you have a fireplace uh, as well so it's cold uh, winter nights you can enjoy that and of course you have this nice mantle up above so and you can hang the stockings if you need to and uh, just absolutely lovely little house here so we'll take a look in the backyard uh, which it does have a pool back here and of course a screen door so you can better see what's going on without having to have any bugs flying in. As we take a look out here, this is a uh, favorite part of the house. So they have a little section over there if you wanted to do some some gardening. Uh, they have a shower head uh, up above there as well. We'll take a closer look. There's electricity obviously running to the shed back here. So you do have the shower head and of course if you guys elected to do some gardening or anything or just some um, some overall hanging out, a little barbecue, you can absolutely do that with a nice deck. You have a new uh, railing all the way around it uh, and then of course you have the pool with the, the diving board so everybody can have a good time, make a big splash. Uh, but absolutely beautiful landscaping of course. Uh, you have this cul-de-sac here so real real friendly uh, environment though and here's a, another look at the back of the house a nice beautiful day out here uh, just an overall huge deck so definitely nice if you want to come out here enjoy a morning cup of coffee or take a seat while you're watching the barbecue or the kids playing in the pool you have a little bench area there as well so we'll take a quick peek back inside the house uh, as we begin to head upstairs As we take a look uh, up here, back into the uh, living room area, you have uh, access there if you guys elected to do a uh, alarm system. You have your half bath down here, uh, and there's access to the garage right here. So swinging back around as we head upstairs, you have uh, these nice beautiful steps up here with a carpet. Kind of as you head midway up, 
and then getting up to the top again you have your uh, hardwood and back to carpet definitely accents very nicely all, through, all throughout here again uh, this is uh, one of three bedrooms uh, very they're all fairly sized here so definitely nice there and excellent carpet it's very uh, padded uh, you guys can't feel that but I can reassure you uh, it's definitely nice and padded uh, for the carpet there so ceiling fans uh, in just about every room I believe um, you have another uh, linen closet there and you have your full bath right here with actually hardwood floors down in there uh, real nice a little different and I like it so we head in here you have an absolutely huge uh, master bedroom so I'll just kind of pan across it so you can see and then one of the coolest features uh, of this house is uh, again like I mentioned another ceiling fan but you have this magnificent fireplace in the master bedroom I think that's too cool uh, so Anybody can kind of relax and enjoy themselves, but um, just to kind of pan across again, absolutely huge bedroom. Step back again so you can really just gauge just how big this thing is. So plenty of space if you wanted to make this an office section, nursery. Uh, you have a large walk-in closet over here as well. And then you have a full bath over here. And that will wrap it up. Uh, you guys can come uh, fill out an application now.